In this video, I'm gonna show you how to schedule posts on a Facebook personal profile. Lots of ways to do it into a Facebook group and on a Facebook business page, but personal profiles, we lost the ability to do that about, I think it's been maybe almost 10 years ago. But now there are two workarounds that I wanna show you today, and I'm showing you both of them just in case one of them doesn't work for you, all right? Let's get into it. Welcome to 5-Minute Social Media, where we help overwhelmed entrepreneurs streamline their social media strategy so they can get more results, more revenue, more profit with less work. If that sounds like something you'd like in your business, take a second, hit subscribe, click that bell. That way you'll be notified each week when we release another helpful video. My name is Jerry Potter. Yes, it rhymes with the boy wizard. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to schedule posts on a Facebook personal profile. So this has not been available to us really in a good way in, I want to say, almost a decade when Facebook kind of took that away. They wanted to make sure people that were being strategic and all of that were moving to business pages. But I want to show you two ways to schedule posts on a personal profile. The first one I think is the best way, and you, if you have it, this is what you should do, but not everybody has access to this yet. The second way is one that should work for almost anybody, but it's just not quite as good as the first one. I'm not really selling the second way, am I? But again, if you just want to make sure that you can plan your posts ahead of time and you want to know, you know, okay, I want to post Tuesday at 8 a.m. and Wednesday at 4 p.m. or whatever it might be. This at least helps you with that. So this first way, what you need to do is you need to turn on what's called Facebook professional mode. Okay. And so I'm on a Facebook profile here and I'm going to click these three dots on the right side under the cover photo. And I'm going to say, turn on professional mode. And then it gives you some of the stuff that you'll get with it, like more insights, the ability to boost your posts, different things like that. So I'm going to click turn on, and then it'll invite you to explore all the stuff about professional mode if you want to see that. Now, if for some reason after this, you don't want to keep professional mode, you can always come back to these three dots and then just choose turn off professional mode. Now I'm on my phone because as of now, the ability to schedule posts on your personal profile is only on phones. And as I said, this is still something being tested and rolled out. So you may not have this. And if you don't, then the second way that I show you should work just fine. So I'm here in the Facebook app, craft a post really quick, doesn't matter what it is. Then I'm going to type that next button in the upper right corner. And as you can see, there's lots of different options here, including the ability to schedule to lots of different Facebook groups, not groups that I'm an admin in. These are just all groups that I'm in. Oh my gosh, I'm in a lot of groups. But also right here near the top, it says publish now, which is pre-selected, or I can say schedule for later. And I tap that one. And then I can go through and I can choose exactly when I want this post to go up. Now, one thing I saw earlier that's not here now, like I said, this is still being tested, was it actually suggested times you could just tap once and choose that's when it would go out. So this is now set to go out at this date and time. I hit post, it uploads and it's now scheduled. I'll tap that little manage button there at the bottom. Here it is. These ones down here are posts that have already gone up, but this is the one that has not gone up yet. So I can type that little X hit next, and then I can delete it if for some reason I don't want it to go up, or I can tap on it. And as of now, it doesn't appear that you can change when it goes up, you can only delete it. So if you turned on professional mode and you have that option, awesome. Maybe by the time you're watching this, everybody will have it. But if you don't, here's the other workaround for scheduling posts on your personal profile. And it's not quite fully pre-scheduling, but it's still a huge time saver. And what you can do is you can take one of the third-party tools that will send a notification to your phone along with the image or the video or the copy of the text when it's time for your post to go up. Let me show you how I'm doing this. As I said, most third-party tools will do this, and I'll link to some in the description of this video, but I use Agora Pulse, which I love. And so what you do is you actually connect an Instagram account, if they don't let you connect a Facebook personal profile, which I, almost all of them won't, you connect an Instagram account and you just kind of pretend it's a Facebook profile. I promise this will make sense here in just a second. So here's all these accounts that I have connected here. And this one right here says links from 5-Minute Social Media. This was actually an Instagram account that I created created that I no longer use, but now I'm using it to post onto Facebook. And here's how. This In this program, Agora Pulse, I select that. Go ahead and add an image and a caption, just like you would for any post at all. And then down here, and this will be a little different depending on what tool you're using, but instead of having it just published directly, because I don't want this to go on Instagram, I'm going to do publish via mobile notification. And so I turn that on. 
and then it has me selected because I'm the only one that's in here. And then I come over and just like you'll do in your tool, whatever it is, choose the date and the time. And then I'm gonna go ahead and schedule it. So now I've got this notification on my phone and whatever app you use may look a little bit different. So I tap on it, opens up my scheduling app, which was Agora Pulse and it says ready to publish, share on Instagram. So I go ahead and hit share on Instagram. It's not going to publish it to Instagram though. What it does, this will come up and just give you some warnings. Your app will probably do the same thing. I say I'm ready. What it's doing is it's saving the image on my phone. If the video would be the same way. And then it's saving the caption to my clipboard so I can paste it in. So now all I have to do is open up Facebook, go to post something. I go ahead and I hit paste on the caption. Then I come to the images, grab that image, hit next. And then I would hit publish and it would go up at the time I wanted. And when it's time for that post to go up, I'll get a notification on my phone. So that's the workaround. And no, it's not perfect. It would be nice if we could pre-schedule to a profile right from Facebook on desktop or uh, mobile, and maybe that will be coming, but that works for now. And here's where it's beneficial, is it's much better than going, oh my gosh, it's four o'clock, I was gonna post on Facebook today, and then having to think of your post, find the image, like this way at least you can be strategic ahead of time, and everything is there. One thing though with this method that I do is when I have, a, you know, when I decide a post is going to go up, let's say I want it to go up at 4.12 p.m. on a Thursday, when I choose that time, I'm, I'm thinking about when I think it'll do well, but I'm also thinking about when will I be available to turn around and then manually publish it once I get the notification, all right? I hope you found this video helpful. If you did, let me know by giving it a like or leaving a comment. And if you really want to grow your business with social media and make more profit through your marketing, um, make sure to sign up for dailysocialmediatips.com. This is where thousands of entrepreneurs get a daily social media tip from me each and every single weekday, totally free. And if they ever aren't helpful, you can unsubscribe at the bottom of any of the emails. All right, so check it out again at dailysocialmediatips.com. Thank you so much for watching today. You're not only supporting me, but also my two tiny superheroes at home.